event, this tag match is going to start off in exciting fashion with the rapping superstar set to lock up. Oh, and a backbreaker! Right to the spine. Oh, look at this. Neckbreaker after the float over. That was pretty. That'll leave a knot on your head. Sometimes I'm surprised R-Truth was able to focus long enough to create a finishing move. When Truth drills an opponent with the lie detector, what usually follows is a one, two, three. Just a vicious elbow. The leg drop. It's all over but the crying. The mighty Rusev looking a bit surprised by this assault. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. The good news is that if it gets too out of control, oh, she has her partner she can tag in while she catches her breath in the corner. Corey, I'd be careful about how you speak our truth. Truth makes sure whenever he drills an opponent with a lie detector that they suffer a direct hit. One of the most dangerous things about the lie detector is our truth can drill an opponent with it, whether truth is on the offensive or defensive side of things. Carmella planted one there. Oh, my goodness. It'll jam your leg in a bad way. Carmella is more dangerous than ever. The princess of Staten Island is filled with a hostility we've never seen before, so if a superstar is going to go up against her, they have to strike early. Boom. Double back elbow. Corey, before you mention that Carmella is more aggressive than ever, if an opponent wants to have any sort of chance against the Princess, they'll need to land significant offense right from the opening bell. I'm all for sportsmanship, but in WWE, you have to know when to fight fire with fire. To all the women in WWE, to even be able to think about victory against Carmella, you have to strike first, strike hard, and strike often. Going for an encore here, right to the midsection, locked in! It's locked in! Incredible. Clearly looking to cut off the flow to the carotid artery. The princess of Staten Island has always been known for her unique brand of offense. But the and she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Simply destroying the back. And the splash hits. And stopping away in the corner. She goes down like a ton of bricks. The moonwalk and Bronco Buster just got Carmella warmed up by forcing her opponents to tap out from the pain caused by the horrific Code of Silence submission. The Code of Silence sends excruciating pain through an opponent's neck and back where it's difficult for them to move, let alone breathe properly. The superstar should do the smart thing and submit before a serious injury occurs. I guess she feels there's something to be said for going back to something that worked before. Oh, that hurt to the spine. Picking the spot. Hair whip! If you remember, guys, Carmella's introduction to the main roster came in 2016 when she was the final pick in the WWE brand extension draft. She's got something in mind. Carmella has eyes to finish. She is on oh, fire. Hair pulled that slam. Carmella is feeling good right now, but she better find a way to finish this thing. Byron noted how Carmella was the final pick in the 2016 draft. I think in a lot of ways, seeing more than 50 superstars get selected before her gave Carmella a bit of a chip on her shoulder. Yeah, it definitely motivated her. No, she escapes it. Yeah, I don't know if she had it locked in fully, Michael. Single leg drop kick. Lana's fading now. You can see her partner wants to get tagged in here. Guys, we're not used to seeing her like this. I wonder how she's going to respond here. Taking off her feet now. And you're not going to win many matches down there. I can tell you that. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than... She counters before it's too late. Oh, man, she's rolling now. Carmella wants to put this away. Code of silence. She is just so dominant.
The tag team competition right now. Not today, guys. I can't believe she broke out of that, Michael. Rusev is tagged in. Got her good with a kick. Rusev showing a lot of heart here, but how can he turn this around in his favor? At this point, she really needs to think about making a tag with a partner. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the... Carmella is in position. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, the New Day. And she escapes the submission. Not a lot of people can break out of that one, Michael. She clearly liked the results from the first time she delivered that move. Wow, she gets tossed in that exchange. Oh, man. That'll tear your hamstring. Carmella wants everyone to know that she's in charge. Boom, right across the small of the back. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. That's how you wear down your opponent. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and whoa. That's it. That's what she needed. Look at her. The shoulders are down. Two. Pins broken up. I can't believe it. And just like that, this move is leading the charge. I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. Here we go. Maybe a figment of your imagination, but little Jimmy hurts. She goes for the cover. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. On November 3rd, 2014, Rusev made history when he became the first Bulgarian-born WWE superstar to win a championship. The Bulgarian group defeated Sheamus to win the United States Championship and was determined to show the world what a dominating champion looked like. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Knee drop. That was nasty. So precise. Rusev's match with Sheamus is regarded as one of the most physical contests in the United States Championship's history. Rusev was quite proud to become the first Bulgarian-born champion. She somehow breaks free. But you have to wonder how much damage was done. It takes some serious issues to be crazier than Randy Orton, but after losing to the Viper in just 10 seconds at SummerSlam, Rusev began to designate every single day as Rusev Day. A oh, brutal impact. Elbow to the heart. We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and I can attest that this is no different. Well-executed drop kick. She got her good there. Hooked up. Back suplex. Three. Four. Whoa, Lana able to avoid damage. Drop kick. Beautiful. Bringing it back into the ring. Uh -oh. Oh my goodness, crushing it. 
Our truth seems to be really worn out. We might be looking at the end of the line for her. Yeah, things look bleak right now. Man, at this point, even the slightest mistake could cost one of these women the match. She's always been a woman capable of great bursts of activity. Plenty of folks behind that strike. There's the switch. Carmella is in. I guess she feels there's something to be said for going back to something that worked before. Oh, the high angle slam. Oh, look, Bruce, nice move. It does not. The accolades locked in. The Bulgarian brute is back in this. What a brutal beating we've seen. And that's it. This one is over. Now let's take a look back at these ladies in action. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. When any superstar, man or woman, is able to find a way to win a match as entertaining and action-filled as that one, they should be grateful and really proud. Some great stuff. Here are your winners, Rusev and the Ravishing Russian, Lana. Rusev leads the way and route to victory here tonight. There's no way around it. When you're locked in a submission move like that, your only choice is to tap out. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time.